the formidable robot. Many of us remember that one show on Cartoon Network named, Ib 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 Ib, right? The show stopped showing after six seasons, which lead to the whole entire staff of the show to be laid off. Many were really mad about this decision, which lead to one of the staff members leaking the original opening episode for season 7. The crew members were mad when they found out that this was leaked. The file was on a torrent site for three days. Only 24 people downloaded it before it was taken off. The people who watched it went insane. Before the episode starts off, a warning is shown, stating the following. Due to money issues, we were forced to stop production for it and and any. This file is not to be distributed to the public, as this episode is only a project. After that, the intro started. I'd think that the intro would be either different, or messed up, but the intro started off like normal. The three ends fooling around like usual, no big deal. After the intro stopped, the title card spelled out, Mayfire. It starts off with the three ends walking down the cul-de-sac, in a bird's eye view. They are running for some reason, which lead Eddie to say, Let's hurry, we're almost at the candy shop! The three ends started to sprint. As they make a turn, the scene fades away. The next scene shows them next to a TV, showing a news broadcast. Urgent. Fire starting in downtown, appears to be heading west to a little neighborhood. Please evacuate the area with caution. What are we gonna do now? Shouted Double D. Ed, in a sad tone, said. What's there to do? We're done. Eddie shouted. No, we're not. There's a safety shelter about ten blocks away from us. We can make it there and survive. This then shifted to another scene of the boys running. The next scene pops up, and it's showing the Eds running for their lives now because of the massive flames occurring in the background. Come on, we can make it! We're only five blocks away! Double D, slowing down, explained. Guys, I don't think I can make it. I'm too weak to keep running. No, you're not Double D! Hop on my back! Yelled out Ed. The scene cuts to black again. It now shows Eddie holding onto Double D's beanie, all torn and mangled up. It was sobbing really hard, while Eddie had a few tears in his eyes. It whispered. We're done Eddie. We might as well go the same direction as Double D did. While Eddie screamed. Don't you say that to me now Ed! Double D wanted us to be safe, so let's do it for the kid! They both started to run now. As they are running, the flames started to spread out more, and much brighter than it was before. As they made their final turn, Double D is shown running down the same pathway as the Eds. Double D, is that you? Said both of the Eds. Yes it is. Hurry up, there are helicopters waiting for us, and they're taking off in two minutes. Yelled out Double D. A split second static occurs, which leads to the next part. It shows only Eddie, all alone, inside a helicopter with a striped shirt and an orange shirt. Double D, Ed, I can't let you guys just die like this. I'm joining you. It shows Eddie jumping off the helicopter into the horrible fire. It then shows a bird's eye view of the cul-de-sac, all burned down. It now cuts to the whole downtown area where the fire started, all disfigured. Buildings were collapsing into each other like dominoes. A radio broadcast is heard in the background, saying, There's still hope in the northern area of town. If there's any survivors, please come over to this region, 